columns. Sometimes we like to group our text into various columns. Instead of having one long uh, piece of tech, M text here, we like to put things into various columns like a newspaper. So if I double click on this M text and we come over to columns, you'll see by default M text is a dynamic column and it's set to manual height. So that's really what it is. And so when we scroll out here and I grab it by the corner and I manipulate it dynamically, it's changing the heights here of my columns. And I come over here and, and as I change the heights, I'm adding another column. So this is a dynamic columns when I am changing it here. So by default, we already are in columns, and dynamic columns uh, in M text. We can switch it to static columns, and static columns uh, is when we come over here to say, well, I want three columns, and I go, well, okay, I want three columns, boom, it creates three columns. Now, when it goes up and down, you'll see that the text is always going to be in three columns. It's just a matter of how tall each column is going to be. So I can then say, well, I'm going to have three columns, but it doesn't automatically change. I'm going to have to manually manipulate the columns. So here we have columns, we have dynamic columns, and we have static columns. And static columns, you tell it the exact number of columns. And in dynamic columns, we have manual height by default, but we can also set it to auto height. In auto height, uh, automatically adjust the height of the columns.